Hi, my name's Claire Greenhow. I'm a career development and personal branding specialist here at Anglia CV Solutions. And today I'm going to take you through a quick LinkedIn tutorial, giving you my top tips to improve your LinkedIn profile picture. Now you're probably one of the thousands, perhaps millions of people across the UK who have a LinkedIn profile account, but have a really rubbish photograph on their profile. Or worse still, you've got no profile picture whatsoever. So follow my 10 top tips and we'll get your profile picture looking good, I promise you. Okay, get your pen out. Number one, use a current picture. It needs to be a true reflection of you. Now whilst you may prefer a picture of what you looked like 10 years ago, if it doesn't look like you now, don't use it. It needs to be a current photograph. We need to see what you look like now. If you're invited to an interview, the interviewer wants to see what you look like and when you arrive you don't want them thinking, oh, is that the same person? Oh, I don't remember that, I never remember that LinkedIn profile. Hmm. So anyway, make sure it's a picture of you now. Number two, make sure it's a picture of yourself. Okay, I know that sounds really self-explanatory, but you'll be surprised how many people have image coming soon or use an avatar. Now, LinkedIn is a social media platform, I do get that, but it is very, very different from Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, and all the other weird and wonderful social networking sites that are you know, popping up every day. It is a business networking platform, so you need to be professional. Your picture needs to be professional, so a silly avatar really isn't gonna cut it. Okay, number three. Use a head and shoulders shot. Something quite similar to the way you see me now. You see my head, you see my shoulders. I'm sat side onto the camera and I'm looking straight at the camera. So make sure it's a head and shoulders shot. If you're gonna upload something that's a full length picture, you are going to look tiny. You're not going to be easily seen. People who click on your LinkedIn profile, they want to see you. It's a proven fact that if you have a good, strong LinkedIn profile picture, you will get more clicks. So make sure it's a head and shoulders shot. Okay. Number four, make sure it's a picture of you. Now, this is again another obvious one, but you'll be surprised how many people get it wrong. Lots of people tend to upload group pictures, pictures with the kids, pictures with the husband, pictures with the friends, pictures with their pet Labrador even. Now, so people want to see you. They don't want to sit there and think, so which one is she? Which one is he? In a group shot, it needs to be a picture of you and you alone. Okay, number five, consider going pro. A lot of the high street photographers these days, um, or even ones that work mobile, can offer you a headshot service. Now this can be quite expensive depending on what you want and what their package is, or you could opt for the cheap option, and that is to ask for passport photographs. Now, they can be converted to, to digital format very, very quickly. A lot of photographers will actually sell you the digital image file as well. So that's a relatively inexpensive way of getting a professional headshot. Um, you may not want to do that. You might want to give it a bash yourself. So it's quick and easy to do. Make sure you take a photograph of yourself against a fairly plain background. I'd recommend white, cream, grey. Stand side on to the background. Stand back away from the background. Otherwise you'll create a horrible, nasty shadow and look into the camera. Smile and take the photograph. Now, be smart. Number six is be smart. You'd be surprised how many people put profile pictures up of them in their beachwear or something completely inappropriate. So if you work in an office, make sure you're wearing office attire. We need to see that you can look smart and what you dress like in your everyday life. Don't turn up you know, for your photograph in something completely inappropriate. You need to show a strong professional business side not jeans and a scruffy old t-shirt or a hoodie or anything like that or a worse still a hat or um, sunglasses. You, it needs to be a picture of you in work attire. Right, so seven, show your best side. Now I touched on this a little bit uh, uh, earlier further back. Um, you need to show your best side. Um, sit on your chair, relax, Relax your shoulders, sit at an angle to the camera, turn your head back 
and uh, look to the camera and smile for probably the most flattering pose. Um, I have googled uh, pose and sitting positions and this one seems to be the most popular so I'll repeat you know sit down relax your shoulders sit at an angle to the camera look back at the camera smile sit slightly forward that's another tip that I actually picked up the other day sit slightly forward and then take the photograph okay now as I said just a minute ago we need to uh, look at number eight and that is to smile you'd be surprised how many people don't smile in their profile pictures if you smile, you look friendlier, you look more approachable and people are therefore most likely to pick, click on your profile as opposed to something that looks like a visual old toad. So make sure you smile, that's top tip number eight. Number nine is to look well groomed. This, you know, it goes hand in hand with being smart really, but obviously well groomed, make sure your hair is done, your makeup is done, you're well shaven. Um, you know, you, you, basically, you don't look like you've got a hangover. Uh, just make sure your appearance is professional. Um, so you, you, you're looking smart, you're wearing smart clothes, you're taking a picture of yourself, it's a head and shot, shoulders picture against a plain background. So we're almost there. Number 10, refresh periodically. Now, we touched base on this earlier. You need to make sure your LinkedIn profile is a picture of you now. It needs to reflect you. You need to put up a picture that's gonna give a true image of what you look like. Because if you do go to an interview and you don't look like your LinkedIn profile, it's going to raise questions. Okay, so they're my 10 top tips to improve your LinkedIn profile. If you have any more, let me know. But if you want to read the blog post, it's up there on our website, which is www professional-cv-writer.co.uk and we have a really comprehensive career advice section. It's really worth going over and having a look. Now if you click on career advice in the top bar you'll be taken to um, a page where there's four different sections. If you click on the LinkedIn section you will find the blog post there. Alternatively we have a search function on there. Just type in that you're looking to improve your profile picture and the blog post will come up there for you as well. If you're still struggling or you're stuck, you've got any other questions or you know want some more advice, just drop us a line. We have live chat on our website, we have email as well. Phone lines are usually quite busy, so you know, bob an email across and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. And I shall see you for the next tutorial. Thank you.